taking on European rivals in Scotland. So this is the first time that these two... We'll start off with the game in general. Uh, a great result for Scotland. What did you make of the game? Uh, yeah, in trying to trying conditions, uh, we said we wanted to put that to the side and try and play with a bit of pace and, uh, and keep the tempo high. And I think for a large period of that, we did that. Uh, it was the first time we sort of had a, a proper sort of test match uh, hit out, so it was pleasing to get that win and, and keep that momentum going for the Six Nations. We need to talk through your your, your, your two tries. Um, Great bit of play for both of them. Just talk us through those tries. Uh, I think the uh, first one was, was great play from the, the forwards, the back. Uh, Benny called the line really well and we got them all set and got it going. And I was just fortunate enough to be hanging on to the back there. And then I think the, the second one came from uh, open play. We, we strung a few phases together and, and really stretched them. And then Finn, I think, made the half break and sort of managed enough load again. And then, I think he was involved twice, so it was, it was great. I managed to pop up in the right area again and uh, flip over the line, so it was, it was good to get the two tries in. And just finally, we're off to Australia now for, for the second test of the summer tour. Do you expect a similar challenge type of game from them? I think Australia, they'll, uh, they'll all try and play a little bit more at pace again. I think uh, any, any, any international team that begins at set piece, and, and that's where. Uh, so you can get the momentum from, so I think we'll, we'll have a challenge there again. Uh, but I, I don't think they'll, they'll sort of try and play as forward do dominated, but like at uh, Murrayfield and, and Nottingham there, uh, it was a great game, it was very open, and uh, I expect to see that again.